Hey y'all, it's Nancy the Handy Scandy. Welcome back for another crafty venture. And welcome to my stop on the Whimsy Stamps Halloween Hop. If you are unfamiliar, Halloween is halfway to Halloween. April is halfway to October, which makes it halfway to Halloween. And so this is our second half Halloween half hop. We had one last year as well. And I am very honored to be sharing a video here on my channel as well as over on Whimsies. And um, yeah, I've had a really good time. I'm sitting here, it's dark outside, it's stormy. I'm drinking a warm cup of coffee out of my favorite Halloween mug. I have my pumpkin spice candle going on. Yes, it's April, <laughs> but it's October at my house. And so I am loving this moment while I do this voiceover. You can see what I'm doing on screen. I think for the most part, it's self-explanatory. I will ask that if you have any questions, please drop them downstairs in the comments. Um, and then I'm just gonna go on into telling you about this hop. So, as I said, this is the Whimsy Stamps Half a Ween Hop. It's also a giveaway. I did not mention that. Whimsy Stamps is giving away a $50 gift card to their online store. Um, all of those details are going to be downstairs in my description box. How late this is, um, this contest runs, if you will. Um, when you need to respond by if your name is chosen, how you'll be alerted if your name is chosen, um, what you need to do as the viewer, all of those things, all of those details will be downstairs in the description box. What I would encourage you to do is to hop along. There are several, we have a couple new designers, so there are several videos this time. In the past, I think we only had like three or four. I think we have a few more this time. So there's, there's new designers, fresh blood, if you will, <laughs> new ideas, fresh inspiration, all kinds of fun stuff to, to see and to do. And we encourage you to hop along, see all the videos, comment, like, subscribe if you're so inclined as you're hopping along. I always say during these hops that you just never know if you're going to find your newest favorite crafter, favorite designer. You just don't know. So I encourage you to do that. Plus, if you do all those things, that gets you eligible to win the $50 gift card. So please, please, please hop along, play along, share the love, <laughs> and make sure that you make yourself eligible to win that gift card. So I think that is everything that I need to say there. If I have missed anything, like I said, it will definitely be downstairs in the description box. Oh, I do want to say that this is a hashtag driven hop, which means if you click on that hashtag in my title, as well as at the top of my description box, you can click on either one. Um, that will populate the playlist of everybody participating. But I'm also going to have all of the, the channel links downstairs downstairs in my description box as well. Man, too early to be doing this. <laughs> the links to everyone's channel will be in the description box as well. So if you'd rather do that route than use a hashtag, feel free to do that if you get lost along the way or if a link doesn't work or whatever. Hop on back here, use my links. Um, yeah, just if you would go ahead and hop along. And, and the main thing I think at least from my perspective is like and comment subscribe if you're inclined but definitely those comments are what's going to get you eligible but you need to comment on every video i don't know if i mentioned that or not either comment on every video and that makes you eligible eligible to win and um check those descriptions downstairs for further information so back to the card or to the card initially <laughs> If you have any questions about how I created that background, um, yeah, just let me know downstairs. One thing I do want to say is when I used that frame, and it's called the treasure map frame, if I remember correctly. Yes, it is the treasure map frame. When I used that to add the detail to the bottom of the die cut, and the die cut is called the Slimline Woodland Cottage die. So what I did not pay attention to was that the die itself for the treasure map die is different on both sides. I don't know why in my head I thought it was the same. It was symmetrical or a mirror image. It is not. So when I went to put the slimline woodland cottage die onto the treasure map die, those little jaggedy edges, the deckle pieces, they did not line up. So you saw me troubleshooting 
on the fly <laughs> trying to figure out how I was going to fix that. Or, or here you will. I'm sorry. I thought this had already passed. So here's where I realized that. Hmm, my decals don't match. What am I going to do? I wasn't going to start over, so we're just going to make it work. Basically, what I want to try to do is cover up all those white splotches that didn't get any ink blending. So I'm adding some scraps of black just to cover that up. And then in some places, I go back and I kind of hand fussy cut some of the decals out. I don't in all, this, in all the places, but in a couple of them I do, just where it was a little more obvious. And then I'm gluing it down. But I do want to talk about that background. So I initially um, heat embossed the, the wood, woodsy stamp. Let me tell you what it's called. It's just called Tree Silhouette. I love it. It's like scary woods. And even though I did it in white, it's still kind of scary. And then I did the ink blending, which I've not done ink blending in some time. You did not see, but I did some water splatters. And then I came back in with the, is it called Starry Night? Star Galaxy Stencil and some of the Tim Holtz Glow Paste. Grit Paste Glow is what it's called. Now, I will have photos at the end, so you'll get to see how well it works, but it does work. You have to charge it up, though. I had left mine um, in the dark, and then I had to come in and, and charge up that glow, but boy, I wish my, my photos were better to show you, but um, yeah, it really does work. So this dead dolly, <laughs> this stamp set is one of my absolute favorites, absolute all-time whimsy stamps favorites. And one of my friends says she hates it, but she always talks about it. And so she was up here um, for a crafty weekend or a crafty day last weekend. And she mentioned it. And I said, girl, I'm going to use that stamp set just for you. So Gina, here you go, my love. <laughs> hello, friend. I say hello, friend to you. She says hello, friend to her lost eyeball. <laughs> Y'all, I can't. So as I wrap this up, Gina, thanks for the inspiration, love. I appreciate you. <laughs> Friends, go ahead and hop along to all of the other channels that are participating in this Whimsy Stamps Half a Ween Hop and giveaway. I want you to become eligible for that giveaway. Those are the glow-in-the-dark photos. Not the best photography, but it, it definitely shows. So hop along, do all the things, <laughs> check downstairs in the description box for more details. And if I've missed anything that you have questions about, if you just have comments, whatever, I would love to chat with you downstairs. So um, until next time, y'all, I'm going to stop rambling. Thank you for spending time with me. Happy Halloween. Until next time, I'm out.